around the council villages in Somerset yesterday. Uh, there doesn't seem to be any rhyme or reason why these villages survive, but there, there are still nine of them in Somerset, not a single one in Devon, and you're the only one in Cornwall. They have a very, very proud in, um, heritage. Um, one thing that Dougie forgot to mention is that we, one of the things we'd like you to do, bear in mind, is um, 4th of August next year is a Monday, but on 3rd of August it would be really, really nice if every thankful village in the country unveils its plaque uh, on that Sunday, and that would unite you all in the common cause of the thankful village. And we'd like to present you with a certificate of, of commemoration just to uh, prove that we were here. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So I'm going to ask our two councillors, because I'm not always around, can I have the two councillors to accept this on behalf of the parish council and make sure that they get it? Of course we are. Really proud to go. Really. There you go. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you all. One more thing. We are fundraising. This is my fundraising head now. We're trying to get this £51,000 for the Royal British Legion. You can go online and do it. You can send a text. He's supporting it. He's supporting what you're saying. So if you want to make a donation, you want to make a donation discreetly, go onto the internet or go on your mobile phone. We'd be very grateful to you. We're trying to raise 51,000 for British Legion, and we hope to do it by the end of the nine days. That's me for the next I would like to thank the pie makers. <laughs> Absolutely. Well said. Okay. We're going to have a, a, a prayer and a blessing. I'm not going to try and uh, persuade the weather to do anything different, because I'm in sales, not management. Whatever goes on out there, I don't know. But here's a prayer of thanksgiving and remembrance. Holy and loving Father, we give you thanks for the safe return of loved ones for our village, fortunate in two world wars. We pray for those communities which were less fortunate and for those who were bereaved, wounded and scarred and whose lives were changed forever by the horrors of war. We pray too for all who have died in the cause of freedom and justice that they may have peace and that all wounds may be healed in the light of your love. We ask this through the Prince of Peace, even Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. 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 And before our act of remembrance, a blessing. God grant to the living grace, to the departed rest, to the Church, the Queen, the Commonwealth, and all people, unity, peace, and concord. And to us and all God's servants, life everlasting, and the blessing of God Almighty, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Amen. 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 We shall grow not old, as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them. We will remember them.